tigers, gorillas, and lynxes. Oh my, the Pittsburgh Zoo and PPG Aquarium has welcomed a few new animals to the park this spring. And today, the new baby lynx has got their first checkup. Here's David Highfield. The Canadian lynxes were born six weeks ago, but today was their first trip to the vet's office without their mother. Head veterinarian Dr. Ginger Sturgeon examined the cubs and revealed their genders. Three girls and one boy. So, yeah, I think he's going to have his hands full having three sisters. Um, but we'll see. We'll see who comes out as the most assertive of the four of them. These cats were the first litter of Canadian lynxes born here at the Pittsburgh Zoo. Up until now, the cubs' mother, Chain, was their sole caretaker, and she keeps a close eye on her bundles of fur. She's very protective. She's right there. She's hissing. She wants to make sure that you are not there to mess with her young little kittens. Chain gave birth to five lynxes, but sadly, one died. According to zoo officials, that's very common for cats who have larger litters. Unfortunately, right now, there's, there's four, but these four look phenomenal. They look healthy. The Pittsburgh Zoo participates in a species survival plan that helps preserve threatened species like the Canadian lynx. Zoo officials said there is a chance not all of the kittens will remain together after their first year. And then they'll probably um, get breeding recommendations to go on to other facilities um, so that we can continue to propagate this species here in captivity to serve as a spokesman for the wild counterparts. There's no timetable for when the kittens get names or when they'll be debuted to the public on exhibit. David Highfield, KDKA TV News. Oh, so cute there. While they're little and they get big.